my vlogs and videos channel, Grace Notes. I'm Grace. These are my notes. I try to post new videos every other day, so click that little bell and the subscribe button for my channel to grow. I so appreciate it. So, here we are at Saturday, finally. Took a little bit of extra time getting this video done, but here we are. Hey, Alfie. Somehow we made it. Slow internet is still slow, but we're working with it. It's been a month now that I've had Alfie. Owning an Italian Greyhound in an area where they're kind of a rare sight, you get some interesting reactions. Alfie is a strutty little guy. He's got a lot of flash. So he gets a fair bit of attention when we're out on our walks. He never really went anywhere except for dog shows before I got him, so he's always still looking for the dog show. pretty cute. Some people don't seem to know that he's a dog and they ask what is that? Oh look at the little whippet. It's not a whippet. He's not a whippet. No he's not. Mm. Or they ask if he is a whippet. He's an Italian greyhound. This is a whippet. Standard greyhounds, whippets, Italian greyhounds, they are from the same group, they're all sight hounds, but Italian greyhounds and whippets are separate breed of dog. And that is the next comment I get a lot. Is he a baby? And most people are shocked to find out that no, he's full grown, that's as big as he's gonna get. Another question I get asked a lot is, are they hard to potty train? Is water wet? Is the sun hot? Yeah, potty training can present some challenges sometimes with these little guys, even when they're adults. Alfie has his high. Alfie has his picky times when conditions must be just so or he won't go. The moons of Jupiter must align with the rings of Saturn. The sun must be positioned correctly in the sky. There's a shadow on the ground. Flying bugs are flying. Cars are driving by. People are talking. Music is playing. Dogs start barking. Wind, rain, weather in general. If it rained yesterday or it's gonna rain tomorrow, so no go. Welcome to Iggy life. It's just an Iggy thing. It's the way they are. I reinforce positively when he does go, especially when I know he doesn't really want to, but he does it because he knows he's going to get a treat. Everything Iggy is a lot of positive reinforcement for behavior that you want them to do rather than punishment for behavior you don't want them to do. Sometimes he does it perfectly and other times, nope. <laughs> And it doesn't matter what kind of treats I offer him. If it's raining outside, nope. He would rather go inside on rainy days. This is why it's not a bad plan to litter train your Iggy. You can actually litter train them like a cat. Another thing with Alfie, he will not potty when he's on his leash. He used to be a show dog, so dog show training taught him not to potty while he was on the leash. So unless he can be free, he won't go. Even if I drop the leash and just let him wander, he won't go. In some ways, I really like that. In other ways, eh, it would be nice if he would go on the leash. And I mean, biology would eventually win the battle, <laughs> right? But it's amazing how long these little guys can hold it. And just when you think you've got their potty schedule figured out, they rewrite the whole code. Consistency and patience is key with these little guys. Even your consistency is not always going to be consistent, but your patience has to be. The funniest thing I've heard anyone say, that skinny dog is skinny. Okay, so sometimes people do look at him and think that he's underweight or he's starving. They want to stuff him full of treats. Alfie actually won't take treats from strangers. Even if it's something he likes, he won't take it from someone that he doesn't know unless I'm there to reassure him, and I appreciate that too, because his current weight is exactly what it should be. It is really so important not to overfeed these little guys. They're built to run, so they're aerodynamic, they're lightweight, they have very light bones, so if they are carrying more weight than they should, 
it puts their bones at serious risk for breaks and very expensive vet bills. You should always be able to see ribs and a little bit of spine and even a little bit of hip bone. That's normal and healthy for an Italian Greyhound. If they lose the definition of their shape, you're feeding them too much. They are great at begging though, so you have to grow a spine of your own so that you don't give in to the deadly cuteness. <laughs> and now, it's time to give in to the review for Cycle 54. Fun Monday! I was mad living again. And the story is entitled, Advice from Dad. And there will come a time when I won't be here anymore. You must take life's issues 75 steps at a time. Make sure you scratch your homework. Be sunny to others. Take care of your greyhound. <laughs> Don't dance. Say yeah to nose rings. Don't slurp and drive. <laughs> well, it's kind of true. Don't slurp and drive. <laughs> That's the best advice yet. Yummy Wednesday! I was making diabolically yummy things. Who likes these? I've had forever in my pantry this package of brownie mix. Cream cheese, cream cheesiness. I wondered when I would ever use these cookie cutters. I'm going to fill the cookies. Abort mission, do not make these. Lilo was a successful test kitchen, but I think I've created something very dangerous. Those. Yeah, I ate them all. And now I want to make more, but I'm trying really hard not to. Miscellaneous Friday. I was recapping my first two weeks with Alfie. Okay, I know. You don't like it. I know. Get one of these now. Here you go. It's always a bit of an adjustment when you get a new dog. He is the perfect Italian Greyhound for me. This was definitely a meant to be thing. We're a solid pair now. What did I even do in life before I got you? Hmm? What did I do before you came along? My little heartbeat. My little shadow. Yes, I do love you. Yeah, I love you. I love you too. Mm. Mm. <laughs> Testimony Sunday! I was talking about shining. Oh, shaky shake! And the thing with cities on hilltops, it's not like they can just move, right? And go somewhere where they're not seen. Where the Holy Spirit is indwelling in a person, it's going to be seen and noticed. That's just the nature of God. That analogy is describing God doing his part. But there is still this part that you have to do. You have a responsibility to share. What's the point of shining if you're not going to share? This thing Christians have with God, it's a relationship. And like any other relationship, it takes effort. But if you invest in this relationship, you'll get more out of it than you could ever imagine. Living room, karaoke, Tuesday. On Wednesday, on Thursday. Parody style! You're a slave to the ringtone Night and day to the ringtone no. You'd even pay to hear the ring Cause you're a slave to the ring of your phone That game was crazy fun when I used to play that with my friend. When you only have 20 minutes to write something, it's pressure, right? And there was like between four and seven or eight of us that would play this every week and then whoever had the most of their parody written in 20 minutes won the game. But everyone had a sing though. <laughs> I miss those peeps in those days. Those were fun times. For Baby Thursday, I was hanging out with these three sweethearts again. For Toy, met an unfortunate end going down this hole. She's really happy with her new one though. You got your hands just holding it.
And there's no life hack for today, but there are all these things that inconveniently happened. Tell me Wednesday! Ha ha! Hi, can I help you? Alfie tends to like to demand attention as soon as I'm looking into the camera. He's very jealous of all of you. <laughs> he doesn't like any attention not to go to him. Right? <laughs> <laughs> what are you doing? Massive photo bomb. And there it is. Cycle 54 is officially a wrap. And that means that I'm ready to come back and do this all again on Monday. Thank you all again for supporting my channel and watching my vlogs. This little channel is in Iggy Love because of him. Yes, because of you. But mad love to you anyway. Bye. Well, I'm out for now, but I'll see you all again on Monday. I love you all. Take care of each other. God bless you. Mwah. Skinny dog is skinny.